Hello, I'm Mr. Gorge, and this is my life. This is where I live. Gorgeous, isn't it? Isn't that right, Kitty? Bye-bye. I have the best job in the world. I'm a paint salesman. It's my job to sell paints to people, whether they're building, renovating, or just want some color in their lives. Oh, hello, it's Mr. Gorge here. Yes. Could I speak to Mr. Bartok, please? Yes. So, you can put this hot pink in the bedroom and then match it with this golden rod. What do you think of that idea? I absolutely love it. I mean, I never would have thought of matching it with the golden rod. Uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's great. So you like the hot pink? Little did I know that hot pink would change my life forever. Well, Kitty, here's the hot pink that the Bartoks wanted. <laughs> what it lacks in colour saturation, it makes up for in its hue. that opener. All right, there you are. I'll get it. You just sit there. <laughs> Where are you, you naughty paint opener? <gasps> well, Mr. Gorge, yes, uh, it's time to take off those bandages. Thank you, Matisse. Finally, I'll be able to see the beautiful world of colour again. <laughs> and how is that? Are you okay? I can't see any colour. This will uh, calm you down. <laughs> so, do you understand now? So, I'm colorblind forever? Yes, that is what I've been trying to explain to you for the last 45 minutes. Right. You see, the hot pink was so hot that it's actually burnt out the color receptors in both your eyes. Now, I think you may be the first man in history that this has ever happened to. And as such, there's nothing I can do for you. I recommend you uh, just go back to life as usual. So, uh, I'm... Colorblind forever. It's not fair, Kitty. I love color so much. Why is it being taken away from me? Oh, yes, I forgot about that. How am I going to be able to work again? I suppose you're right. As long as I have a never ending passion for color, my job is safe. You're fired. Hello.
Now what am I going to do? Paint is the only thing I know. People won't want to hire a veteran like me. No. I don't want to eat anything. I just want to sleep. Carla. What have you got for me, Mr. Terry? Well, anything. Preferably paint related. Well? Absolutely nothing. Nothing today. Nothing tomorrow. You know, finding a job for you is harder than a really hard avocado. You know the type that's so hard you can't spread it no matter how hard you try? That green stuff isn't going to be reduced to a spreadable paste anytime soon. Hmm. Not today. Not tomorrow. Not the day after. See some colour. So, how are you today? I keep dreaming of beautiful colours. Then I wake up and I'm back in this black and white nightmare. Still struggling. Last few days have been very tough. Day. Mr. Gorge, you've been colorblind now for three months. Do you even know where you are? <laughs> he lost all the color from his vision. 
took it rather badly, and uh, he must have gone crazy. Why did he try to paint his eyes? Well, he used toxic paint, so either he wanted to end it all, or <laughs> uh, he couldn't read the color warning. What has that nut job done now? I don't really know how to explain this. I mean, no alarms went off. No one could have come in or out. What did you throw him yesterday? What is it, Nurse Bush? 